have been listening keenly to both Honorable Bayer and Honorable Captain Ruega on the matter of insecurity in Lamu County. And I'm sure I also listened keenly to the previous speaker, the leader who was speaking on, uh, here, I think last week or but one, uh, from Lamu. I can't remember her name properly. Uh, but, Mr. Speaker, my plea is that let all these leaders sober up. The, the issue of insecurity in Lamu County has got a very long history. I remember vividly oh, oh, the times when there were chaos in uh, Mpeketoni and people lost their lives, very many people. And all these people are Kenyans. So I have to agree with you, Honorable Bayer and Honorable Captain, that we cannot uh, put an ethnic tag on crime. Criminals are criminals. And that is why we have got our security agencies being paid by taxpayers' money. It is only in Lamu, Mr. Speaker, that we have had now the KDF being deployed almost permanently to deal with internal, internal security issues. I'm not even sure if this House gave an approval for the KDF to be permanently based in Lamu to deal with petty crimes of people killing one another. Mr. Speaker, the issue of insecurity in Lamu and indeed this issue of insecurity in any other part of this country requires that we allow the security agencies to do their work. And they do their work impartially, objectively, and expeditiously. How I wish that the perpetrators of these crimes in Lamu are apprehended the soon as possible and taken to court. Mr. Speaker, as I conclude, the other day we were told that a list of the instigators of this violence in Lamu will be published. I, I was waiting to see what, what are the, these names that are being published. Yesterday I saw a list in the media from the DCI. If you look at that list, you get worried, Mr. Speaker. And therefore, I want to say this. I want to say this. We don't want lists of instigators of violence being published. We want to see those people being arrested and taken to court. Why publish names of people and photos? We want them arrested. Let us know what is the problem in Lamu before we adventure into uh, Haiti and other uh, foreign places. This is a critical matter, and Kenyans are losing their lives. It doesn't matter whether it's either it's a Kikuyu, a Giriyama, as you said, I don't know who else lives in Lamu, a Luo, or okay, a Pokomo. Those are Kenyans, and the security agencies must do their work. Thank you.